guys. It's Sunday evening around five o'clock. Uh, I got my lazy ass up. I think I'm gonna work on the car. The Subi's right there, so I'm gonna uh, do some probably bondoing and then some sanding and see if I need to fix anything else on the car. Uh, probably head to O'Reilly's or AutoZone to get a um, what you call it? whole gallon of uh, oil. Probably do that too. So yeah, let's get started. Okay, so um, right now I'm filling with the rear bumper, trying to get it uh, the fitment a little bit better than what it was. Uh, it was hanging out a bit. There's a lot of rust on the uh, what you call it? the bumper frame. Um, the screws that I forced into there are also rusted. You can see. Let's take a look. Let you guys take a look. So I'm trying to get this behind the tail light thingy. Uh, as you can see under or in there, it's pretty rusted and whatnot. I sprayed some, uh, sprayed some Duraplex spray paint a long time ago, trying to stop the rust from uh, eating up the whole metal and whatnot. Before it was like this. And now we're gonna what you call push it in a little bit and make it uh, flush or as flush as uh, I can make it and whatnot. So yeah, I'm gonna do that and uh, get back to you guys. Okay, much better. I got it flushed. I got three screws going directly into the frame. Uh, pulling on it it's not coming out so I got that part done um, I'm gonna try to get this part lined up uh, a little bit better after I work on the body a little bit more um, what I need to work on right now is pulling these right here the bumper out and then screwing it onto the um, screwing it onto the quad body so it uh, matches much better because right now it's like that and you can see once it comes out it looks much better looks like it's whatever um this i found a guy on um youtube uh he has the same build the same kit same car he's asian he has a cat but he hasn't updated his uh, channel in like a year. So I'm gonna do the same thing and flare it on, like basically cover all this onto the edge. Um, probably right here. He had it starting here. I don't wanna bond, I don't wanna add too much bondle onto her. So yeah, I'll, I'll figure something out for that. Um, this is temporary but i added a a nub right here all i need to do is uh get this fastened um this is a temporary thing too so get this fastened uh in it hits the see pressing hits the inside so it doesn't go all the way in so i got that kind of fixed until i can find like a lock mechanism or something on there uh I need to pull it out a little bit more, but that's okay. Let's go to the side panels. Okay, these need to be uh, worked on a little bit more. Uh, I got a little bit right here that needs to be filled in by Bondo. 
uh, and I work on these grooves. Uh, these grooves are the hardest one to work with. And then same thing here. Now I got a little bit more. If you put a stick uh, right here, then there's something that I need to fill up over here and start sanding it. Um, as for the lip, I am trying to find a lip to, uh, what you call, to replace these. So I don't need to sand them down because these these will need to be sanded down and everything. Um, they were black before. So, yeah. That's fine. Let's go to the other side. Actually, the bumper right now will probably be the one that uh, will be Tasha. But I am planning to order another bumper. Um, a cleaner bumper to install. This side needs to be flared out here. I'm going to flare this out uh, and then heat it up a little bit, see if I can conform it, and then drill it in. Uh, as you can see, there's a little gap right here that i got to work with. This was like, this kit was actually in, uh, installed in a rush, so this one is, doesn't line up. So I will have to sand this down right here, probably that much, and then get them to match up as uh, much as possible. I mean, the wrap will pretty much cover everything. It'll be too busy, so you can't really, you know, see it. Also, I just bondled uh, this piece right here. I'm gonna just work on this side for today until it gets dark. Um, I just need a little bit more left over here. As you can see, when you put the stick right there, that is all I'm missing, it's right here. That's it, to get it even out. I'm trying to flare it in uh, as much as possible. Again, I'm gonna have to work with this right here. There's a hump, like when it goes down. Yeah, it's trying to get this even as possible. Nah, uh, this kit is a little bit forgiving. I mean, right now the uh, body panel right here, I gotta sand it down and get this part even. There's inserts right there I need to fix too. Uh, I need to replace these. Uh, this is coming out right there. Uh, I need uh, I got rudder strips for the top, but I'm waiting to put them on after wrap has been put on. I haven't taken off this wrap because I'm pretty sure under here it's uh, horrible because you can see the paint peels and stuff. And I'll need to, um, yeah, it's bare metal probably under there. I don't want it to rust. Uh, the rain is unforgiving in Houston. So, I mean, that's that's pretty much what I need to do um, for the front bumper. I need to take that off um, and probably sand it down and clean it as much as possible and fill up some of the holes that are in there unless I'm gonna uh, reinsert the um, canards that uh was used there before uh this lip i'm not sure if i want to use the lip again um but i mean when they're when they're all in one color it looks nice right now it's like black and white and you're like uh you know uh these light needs to be changed out get new ones i'm getting new headlights uh, i'm trying to find a one piece but there are a uh there's one with a uh with a retrofit in there and um I want those and probably do these ambers uh this time around. I uh, would have to change that to amber too. Uh the hood it's primered right now but it's in rough shape. So what I'm gonna need to do is sand it down again um and then reprimer it uh whenever I have time for that. And uh yeah I might look for a new grill and maybe the junkyard will have one. It needs to be pushed out a little bit. Uh, I think this had front end damage. Yeah, for sure it had front end damage. The hood doesn't line up uh, completely. So I'm going to find a way to like fix that on my own. Um, there is a big crack over here. So that needs to be... This, this whole windshield needs to be changed out. Um, I probably won't get to it. Uh, 
maybe after August because this is uh this is like two three hundred dollars already here and I'm trying to I'm trying to deviate everything where I don't need to spend as much money as possible uh, these needs to be changed to the weather seals and stuff they're getting old this is 2001 but it's been through uh it's been through a lot I need to find uh a way to take this off because the uh the screw in there i'll probably have to drill it out uh the screw in there is actually stuck i can't take it out it's like uh what you call yeah it's giving me a pain in the ass and then there's this weird strip that's all dried out it needs to be replaced too i mean these needs to be repainted and everything so yeah there's there's a lot of work to do um uh, interior wise it doesn't need anything uh i'll keep it simple in there Need some uh, need to replace something in there, but probably speakers because uh, you know the radio quality kind of sucks. But yeah, uh, I'm a I'm gonna work on I'm gonna work on the car, and then uh, the battery's gonna die on the GoPro in a little bit, so I don't want to just you know use up footage and whatnot. Um, but yeah, uh, if you wanna, I'm a I'm gonna start vlogging. Um, I say I'm a lot, huh? Yeah, I'm gonna I'm start vlogging uh, about the with the Subaru the project until we get to the uh, wrapping stage. Once we get to the wrapping stage, well, that's Anime Matsuri, and that's the goal. That's June, I think, the first week of June. So we'll do that. So uh, if you want to see more, because um, I think every weekend, at least Sunday, I will start working on the car little by little. Um, and then uh, do a vlog here and there to keep y'all updated. And if y'all want to see more, just click the subscribe, like button, comment. I mean, you guys can tell me if I'm doing something wrong or y'all can. I mean, you know, uh, if, if you have a GC, you know how it is. You have a car regardless, a project car, you know how it is. So this, this has a lot of TLC that needs to be done to it. And... Um, yeah, so I'm going to get to that. And uh, I'll see you guys later.